Today, we'll discuss the advantages and disadvantages of drinking warm water first thing in the morning. The benefits of drinking warm water throughout the day, the impact of warm water on oriental medicine, and a number of other significant details are all covered in the movie. So, please see the entire video. In addition, I want to point you that 92% of people watch our station without a subscription. I'm waiting for individuals who view the channel without subscribing like the team's effort, subscribe, and ring the bell. Ray out the red subscribe button. Thank you and have a good time viewing. It's no secret that a lot of us begin each day with a hot cup of tea or fragrant coffee at breakfast. These beverages do in fact energize and invigorate you throughout the day. But it raises the question of whether using these items first thing in the morning is appropriate. We are all aware that staying hydrated and consuming adequate fluids is essential for good health. Good nutritionists start their days with a glass of clean water to get their metabolism and digestion going. What if we told you that drinking water at the right temperature is just as crucial as drinking enough of it? We shall investigate the advantages of utilizing warm water in this video. The Benefits of Warm Water as Prescribed by Oriental Medicine China is where the idea that warm water has health advantages first appeared. Their yin and yang dual philosophy is still felt today. Chinese medicine claims that drinking cold water throws off the body's yin and yang equilibrium. The ideal water temperature is that of our body. Within a range of 37 degrees is ideal. It is seen as a chilly start if you are ill. After that, drinking hot water is required to get the equilibrium back. This idea contends that drinking cold water is never advised since doing so wastes the kidney's energy because cold water heats up in the stomach owing to the action of the kidneys. So, drinking warm water is healthier for your body's wellness. It is more difficult to drink and does not taste as wonderful as cold water. Start slowly with a few sips and then consume as much liquid as you can. Then every day raise the quantity. Warm water does not require digestion or heating. Thus, it enters the intestines rapidly without being processed in the stomach. To avoid mixing with food and digestive enzymes, be careful to consume this beverage on an empty stomach. Due to its quick transit through the stomach, this type of water is also known as fast water. Any more fluids? Enzymes are needed to pre-treat morses, kissels, or compotes in order to convert complicated components into simple ones. However, warm water doesn't since it quickly absorbs and doesn't weigh down the body. The health advantages of drinking warm water first thing in the morning. First, consuming warm liquids quickens metabolism. Drinking a glass of pure water first thing in the morning has long been recognized to increase metabolism. Cold water does the same thing, but warm liquid kickstarts the metabolism far more quickly. Particularly if you add lemon or ginger to it, it increases body warmth and stimulates metabolic processes. The latter is an additional source of beneficial compounds that aid in cleansing the body and improving digestion. Additionally, it enhances digestion. Constipation can be treated with warm drink. It makes feces softer and makes it easier to get rid of them. Such water also removes toxins and pollutants from the intestines. It encourages the excretion of digestive enzymes required for digesting high-quality meals. Warm water dissolves lipids and enhances their excretion, in contrast to cold water, which makes it challenging to excrete fats. If not, atherosclerotic plaques can develop and deposit on the blood vessel walls. This type of water may be used both before and after meals to aid in the gastrointestinal tract's activity and the absorption of beneficial ingredients. Thirdly, it makes the intestines function normal. Insufficient fluid intake prevents feces from passing easily through the gut. Constipation and stomach ache are brought on by this. You should consistently consume at least two liters of water to prevent this. Warm weather is ideal. Such a liquid accelerates intestinal motility and makes it easier for the contents to pass through due to its properties. Fourth, it helps the body rid itself of pollutants. With the aid of the colon, this water rids the body of hazardous chemicals by promoting peristalsis and the elimination of extraneous waste. Additionally, it enhances the function of the liver and kidneys 
which are responsible for purifying the blood of toxins and eliminating them from the body through urine. Always consume enough liquids to maintain healthy urinary tract function. Fifthly, it reduces cold symptoms. The virus is easily removed from the body with the use of warm water. That is why it advises drinking a lot of liquids to combat colds. It soothes dry cough, especially if you combine it with honey or lemon. Such a recipe has been around for a very long time. Additionally, drinking warm beverage reduces edema in the airways and the sufferings. Compared to cough medicine, the impact is significantly better. Warm water, in contrast to them, has no harmful side effects or contraindications. The sixth is beneficial for urinary system illnesses. It's crucial to drink a lot of fluids when you have cystitis, which is an inflammation of the bladder mucous membrane. It aids in symptom relief and the removal of dangerous germs from the organ. In particular, warm water with lemon or cranberries works well. Because of the acidic environment it creates, a drink like this kills pathogenic organisms. The seventh eases discomfort. The smooth muscles of the internal organs can be relaxed and spasms can be removed with the use of hot water. This therapy relieves headaches brought on by vasoconstriction, the uterus, or menstrual discomfort. The eighth helps to make skin seem better. Indirectly, you also cleanse your skin as you remove toxins from your intestines. Its many rashes and peeling are the root of its blocked body. Regularly drinking warm water helps you maintain healthy, blemish-free skin that is smooth and clean. For the majority of people, one to two liters per day is the minimal need. If the water is warm, it will be more beneficial and effective. The eighth increases blood flow. The blood is diluted, detoxified, and given a better blood flow to all the organs and tissues when there is enough fluid in the body. The tenth increases youth. The life cycle of the cells in different tissues and organs depends on water. The optimum solution for this purpose is warm water. Ancient healers and doctors were aware that the body becomes desiccated due to a lack of fluid. The elderly are most affected by this. After all, the tissue's water content drastically declines with aging. Consequently, it's critical to obtain enough of it from the outside. Blood that is too thick might result in headaches, thrombosis, and other problems. By consistently consuming lukewarm water, you can shield yourself from such effects. One glass a day is the minimum. Many more is preferable. By doing this, you'll encourage the kidneys and intestines to flush out noxious compounds and free radicals that may otherwise kill healthy cells. Additionally, enough fluid tones, hydrates, and removes flakiness and wrinkles from the skin on the face. 11. The bones benefit from drinking water in the morning. As we previously mentioned, warm water thins the blood and enhances organ and tissue circulation. Similarly, the muscular system is not an exception. The proper blood flow ensures that all tissues receive enough nutrition. Additionally, calcium, which is a component of bone structure, may be found in mineral water. 12. The best way to avoid the flu is with a glass of water. Regular hydration strengthens your immune system. The lymphatic system is stimulated and blood circulation is improved while using warm water. The body defends itself against flu and UERVI viruses using these two elements. Why do you need to drink warm water all day? Warm water should be consumed throughout the day for the multifaceted impact, not only in the morning or evening. You put your body to work and kickstart your metabolism in the morning. People who desire to shed extra weight must go through this procedure in particular. Your body will be better prepared for food intake if you drink a warm beverage in the morning and eat a smaller quantity. Because water occupies a portion of your stomach, you feel full faster. It increases the activity of digestive enzymes and facilitates the absorption of nutrients from meals. In addition, hot water stimulates the excretion of lipids rather than their absorption and accumulation on the walls of blood vessels since it dissolves them. By drinking warm water throughout the day, you will restore normal kidney function and get rid of free radicals that harm the body's cells. You can nourish and moisturize your skin, get rid of wrinkles, and stop unsightly peeling by maintaining a healthy water balance. Additionally, 
you improve your immunity and return your blood pressure to normal. A glass of drink helps with sleep and makes it simpler to get to sleep at night. Everyone should drink warm water throughout the day to maintain their health and youth. Contraindications Warm water usually never produces adverse effects, in contrast to many goods that have a variety of contraindications. However, you should drink water cautiously if you have certain illnesses. It is best to speak with your doctor about the recommended quantity of water if you have a chronic renal illness that is accompanied by edema and high blood pressure. Avoid negative responses by avoiding adding the water if you are sensitive to honey, lemon, or ginger. If you have a gallbladder nodule, you should limit how much liquid you consume since warm water increases bile flow and can result in stone movement and discomfort syndrome. People who have various forms of true hypertension should exercise caution. It is preferable to restrict the usage of warm water when digestive tract inflammation, such as gastritis or pancreatitis, is exacerbating. You should avoid drinking warm water in the summer or during hot weather to prevent overheating. Warm water should be used in moderation if you have acute cholecystitis, which is an inflammation of the gallbladder, since it may make your discomfort worse. Consult your doctor about the acceptable quantities before drinking warm water if you are susceptible to edema as a result of heart, vascular, or kidney illness. It's vital to remember that all of the advantages mentioned above only apply to clean, warm water. It won't happen if you consume hot tea or a herbal concoction. If you routinely drink one to two liters of hot water for your body's health and attractiveness, you won't have colds, dehydration, joint problems, or other symptoms. Consider adding lemon or mint to warm water as the taste is particular and not everyone can easily drink it. You'll normally drink the recommended amount of fluids as a result. The video comes to an end here. Many fascinating films on the advantages and disadvantages of fruits and vegetables, as well as illnesses and how to treat them, may be found on the channel. Therefore, do remember to click the bell and subscribe to the channel. If you donate a nickel and share the video with your loved ones, more people will be appreciative. Next to you.